Are you tired of spending hours recording voiceovers or narration for your content? What if I told you there was a way to automate the process and create high quality audio in a fraction of the time? This introduction is my voice, but I did not say this. If you're a content creator who pays for voiceovers on Fiverr, which can get pricey, or even want to create short form content like Reels, TikToks, but not necessarily want to do your voiceovers manually every time, which can get time consuming. What if I told you there was a better way of doing this using AI? There's a tool using which you can automate this process of creating voiceovers in your own voice. If you're looking for such a tool, this is a video for you. Let's get into it. In this video, we are going to discuss a text to speech AI voice generator. One in particular that has become very popular recently. In this tool, you can use one of the pre-made voice models or create your own unique voices, even use your own voice. Like the intro you heard, I didn't say that. It was generated. The tool we are going to discuss is called Eleven Labs. Very easy to use. This is a, again, a text-to-speech AI generator. It uses a, their proprietary technology, which they call Prime Voice AI, that understands the context of the text. It puts the intonations and inflections at the right places. This makes it even more natural and engaging. Mind you, though, if you're training with your own voice, you have to speak at the right intonations and right pace because the result, the output of the any text that is trained on your voice will reflect what you input. This is a great option for content creators. Speaking of the pricing of the tool, this is a free tool. You don't have to pay for it. If you are not using for commercial purposes, you have to attribute 11 labs though if you are using the free version you can use the starter subscription and also creator subscription as well and various different higher levels of subscription but i think at this moment when this video is being recorded you can only clone your voice using the starter pack it's not available in the free version but the starter pack at the moment is only one dollar for the first month so you can sign up using one dollar and cancel it right away it's creator pack which is 22 dollars it will give you about two hours of voiceovers which is still cheaper than hiring a voiceover actor as you can see this is the 11 labs website prime voice ai that's what they're calling the ai you can get started for free you can create you can actually generate a random text in the language of your choice and on the right hand side you have this text box here where you can click on any of these languages above i'm going to click on english to create a random yep that's how it's Sounds like pre-made Adam. We have, they have this pre-made voice models here. I have found I like Sam quite quite a bit actually. Sounds quite natural. So there are different use cases that you can use the tool for. You can use it for storytelling. <laughs> Holy guacamole! This must be the best joke I've ever heard, Richard. Absolutely sublime. An AI that can laugh. That is pretty impressive. Audiobooks. The Great Gatsby. Chapter one. That's amazing. They have this speech synthesis section, which we are going to cover in a bit. They also have voice lab where you can clone your own voice or create your own unique voices. And if you go to showcase here, under showcase, you have demos, which will take you to their YouTube channel and audio story AI, stories from the past read by AI. To hear even more samples, go there. And the pricing, pricing is free forever, get free. The only thing is that you cannot use it commercially. For example, if you want to sell an audiobook, you cannot do that. I'm really sure about the YouTube videos, but if you're making money from it, I don't think you can use the free version there either. But API access is free if you're a coder and want to play around with it. You have the API access here. You get up to 10,000 characters a month, create up to three custom voices. Whereas in the startup pack, first month is 80% off, which means you only have to pay $1 for the first month I signed up and canceled right away. So I only paid $1. What's included in this? 30,000 characters. In that, the free 10,000 is also included. So you actually get 40,000. Instant voice cloning is pretty amazing. I'll show in a second actually. Here, you can actually use it for commercial purposes, but it won't be much. If you are creating shorts and TikToks and reels and short form content, it will be enough for you, $5 a month. But if you are creating, getting serious and looking for faceless YouTube videos, maybe around like one video is like 10 minutes. And probably you'll need to have a look at creator pack which is 22 dollars a month you'll have to sign up click on the sign up button to sign up once you log in you have 
speech synthesis voice lab and the history and resources here on the speech synthesis page this is where you actually create the voiceovers like on the front page that we have seen we have all this pre-made i also have a cloned my voice before so that's what you see here and you have the voice settings you have the stability i haven't played around with it a lot but you can adjust it clarity and similarity enhancement to increasing variability can make speech more expressive without expressive with output varying between regenerations it can also lead to instabilities so you'll have to play around with it i leave it at default and really get good results so i don't really touch it low values are recommended if background artifacts are present in generated speech this i have actually noticed sometimes when you generate with uh, some voices there are some background noises because people I don't know the trained data set had background noises those voice audio that the models had been trained with i suppose they had background noises click on to default if you mess it up to bring it up to the default value you have two models here 11 monolingual and multilingual here is just going to be producing your voiceovers or audio in english monolingual is fine you have english german polish spanish italian french portuguese and hindi at the moment more coming so they say it is experimental there are it appears that there are some limitations here some numbers and symbols may be currently pronounced incorrectly for the best results please spell them out so let's try this i have a sample text here generate in today's fast-paced world we all struggle with productivity from time to time but don't worry there are some simple things you can do to boost your productivity and get more done in less time not bad at all not bad at all that's the speech synthesis section. If you come to Voice Lab, you won't have access to instant voice cloning if you're on a free plan. So voice design. Voice design is you can add a voice that is randomly generated. So you can select male or female and young, old, middle-aged, old, quite like the middle-aged British accent. Even more than that, I thought it would be fun to actually check the Indian act for fun. Maybe crank up the accent strength to high and see what it generates. First. We thought the PC was a calculator. Then we found out how to turn numbers into letters. And we thought it was a typewriter. <laughs> That's funny. Anyway, British, middle-aged or old is what I quite prefer actually for a documentary style, David Attenborough style, that kind of voice. This generated voice is unique. First, we thought the PC was a calculator. Then we found out how to turn numbers into letters and we thought it was a typewriter. Once you're happy with a particular voice, use the use voice button here and then you give it a name and this will appear in the British Middle East. Create the voice in your dashboard, in your voice lab, that will appear here. That will also appear here in the speech synthesis page. This is under generator, so kind of organized there. So from the voice lab page, you just click on use and then it will take you to the speech synthesis page. Generate. In today's fast-paced world, we all struggle with productivity from time to time. But don't worry, there are some simple things you can do to boost your productivity and get more done in less time. Let's have a look at the cloning. So what you need to do is, I have already cloned it here, you can see it here. So what I did was I just read the text or research that I had done for this particular video and then recorded my on my phone and uploaded it. I'll show you how to upload this. So you just have to create on click on create uh, add voice here come to instant voice cloning and that will take you to this and give a name i'm going to upload it one by one i have two files here this has to be 10 mb each well up to 10 mb it says here the sample quality is more important than quantity noisy sample samples may give bad results and you can give a label here description is not really needed you'll have to Confirm that you're not going to use it for like legal fraudland or harmful purposes. Makes sense. It is, I can see the potential for using it as a cloning someone else's voice and using that, especially scammers can get away with this. Agree to that and add voice. It'll take a like 30 seconds or so to add the voice. All right, hash one here. I'm gonna use this here now. Let's listen to it. In today's fast paced world, we all struggle with productivity from time to time. But don't worry. There are some simple things you can do to boost your productivity and get more done in less time. That is pretty amazing. That is my voice, and that's how you how I speak. All right, okay. Uh, a lot of people are going to lose their jobs <laughs> because of this. You can do the exactly same thing. You 
with the uh, celebrity's voice or someone who you like download the voice from youtube cut it up into like 10 mb just extract the audio only and upload it and voila you have uh, you have the your favorite actor actress or celebrity pop singer their voice anyway that's the uh, gist of it, all of it and you can come to history to see all the things that he had done with this tool there are more resources how to help and tutorials documentation for developers for using api if you're an api get an how to get an api key set up an account you probably wouldn't be if you're a content creator and not a coder unlike me you probably wouldn't be interested in that but if you want a video on how to use 11 labs api to do build cool stuff drop a comment below and i'll show you that in a different video it's not a complicated tool to use it's pretty intuitive so you may like this video check it out